Now question number 19, it says number of pair of integers whose sum are equal to their product. So that means we need to find two numbers such that x plus y is equal to xy. Now this is very standard equation. So we solve this equation by taking xy on the left hand side. We connect x minus xy and plus y. Now what we'll also do is we'll subtract minus one from both sides. Now here we'll take x common. We'll write x one minus y plus y minus one equals minus one. So here if we'll take y minus one common, we'll write y minus one, one minus x is equal to minus one. Then we can write y minus one into x minus one, and this is equal to one. So we get this form as y minus one into x minus one is equal to one. Now, since x and y, they're both integers. So that means these two factors, they should be integer and product of two integers is one only when either both of them, they're one or when both of them are minus one. So first case, when y minus one is one and x minus one is one, that is when the value of x is two and the value of y is two. And the second case when y minus one is minus one and x minus one is also minus one. That is when the value of x is zero and the value of y is also zero. So number of pairs of such integers is simply two, which is zero comma zero and two comma two.